just after 4 p.m. I am currently 20 miles and 33 minutes away from the Jacksonville Jaguars Stadium. That's going to be my next step is head down there and find parking. I'm pretty sure parking lots would already be open. I think about four hours before the game usually when they do it. So by the time I hit Jacksonville, I should be good. You've been to the stadium before? Yeah. So how does, well, I'm just on vacation. I'm from Pittsburgh. I wanted to see the stadium. How does it work when I get closer? Should I just park at the stadium or is there better? There'll be um, open parking around the stadium. So as soon as I hit the exit, just kind of start looking You'll around. You'll be yeah. parking. Okay. Some of them are by parking pass only, but the ones in Mars will say like twenty dollars or thirty. No, that's what my next question was. What's a fair price so I don't get ripped off? Probably don't want to pay it over forty. Don't pay over forty. Okay, because back home I'm from Pittsburgh. They pay charge like eighty bucks for yeah. parking some games. I mean, you have to walk it's, a few blocks, but it's that's like, not the end of the world. Exactly. Take the sights and hey, have a good one, you guys. Go Jaguars. It's still at least moving. I'm a mile and a half away from my exit, but I'm in pretty bad traffic now. Game day football traffic. Well, I just took the Jacksonville exit, and this is the first thing I'm looking at. Is that in this mini mart? It's not looking like it's the nicest area. Going up on the bridge. Wow, look at how pretty that is. That is beautiful. I know it's hard to see because cars keep getting in the way. That is absolutely beautiful out there. Wow. And then there's downtown Jacksonville. I have no idea where I'm going to park yet, but I figured this was probably the best shot of the stadium I was going to get. Hey, quick question. Where's going to be the cheapest parking? Just keep going down. Okay, thanks you guys. Have a good one. Just so I can't forget, I parked at this lumber company whatever it's called it's in the background right there but that's where i parked they charged me 20 bucks supposedly it went up it used to only be ten dollars people were saying last season but even this season it was 10 bucks until today but oh well 20 bucks for parking that sounds like a deal compared to pittsburgh pennsylvania's parking so we'll take it i appreciate you guys watching please like share and subscribe there's the lumber company i parked at and then if you look over there's the bridge that goes over the river some tailgating and then there's the stadium right down there. So I just gotta walk down to there and I'll be at the game. Slowly walking toward the stadium and I noticed behind me, right there behind me to the right, there's like these train things. I'm guessing it's some sort of bar, kind of looks cool. I don't really know what I'm doing right now. I still have like three hours till the game starts. So just kind of wandering around, walking toward the stadium, but I might try to find either a bar or some tailgaters to hang out with. I don't know, try to meet some friends can't go wrong with that just enjoying the fact that i'm down here in jacksonville florida right now just gonna change the pace all you can do is enjoy every day as much as you can and live life to the fullest if there's something you really want to do just go do it don't sit there and think that in a month or two you'll be in a better situation and that'll be the time to do it now i'm not saying go and blow every dollar you have just to have fun but have fun but also make sure not to go overboard with just saving money that's all Finally about to knock Jacksonville off the bucket list another one that I have seen and I'm about to be inside Yo, I thought it was really creepy. That's what it looks like when they look stuff up could be mistaken anybody from Jacksonville leave in the comments But two older folks that I was standing next to was telling me that this white building over here is for Concerts and they have a Jaguars practice facility in there. So please tell me here's the stadium so this is the Jaguars actual stadium where they play and then I was told that that's a practice facility and for concerts so I don't know. As soon as you walk into the stadium at least from the entrance I came in there's this really cool statue that people are taking photos in front of. I already took a photo in front of it so I don't need to get back in line. There's a pretty good line right there but it is a pretty cool statue. Something to do just something with the family. It's pretty cool. Yo, I didn't realize you can still go in here. I'm about to find out what this big white building is. Let's check this out. Yeah, it's definitely a concert. Hopefully I don't get copyrighted. Walk through that entrance way back there that's what that white thing outside was that it was a concert venue but now i'm gonna go into where the stadium is let's go see the field i have made it i'm in jacksonville at the stadium even 
even though it's a waste of so much money, I usually buy the souvenir cup when I'm in town just to have a souvenir to take home, but they're sold out. They said they're out for the rest of the season, so whatever. Finally made it to my seat. I'm row G, seat 16. I'm only seven rows from the field. I'm right near the end zone. Let me show you what I'm looking at.
trying to get out of the stadium. Everyone keeps screaming Duval, which a lot of people don't know, but that's actually the area down here. The township, like how Pittsburgh's Allegheny County. So it's kind of cool. TTAA Bank Field. Man, that was so much fun. That was awesome that the Jaguars won. The only unfortunate thing is I'm supposed to drive all the way to Miami now and that's like four hours plus and that's without traffic. So I know it's gonna be a long drive. I don't know what I'm gonna do. This traffic already, see it piling up behind me. It's getting pretty bad. So right now I'm just gonna to get to the car, maybe chill, smoke for a second and then work my way toward Miami. That's the goal. The new Humvee. The dude told me that he just spent $104,000 on it. Brand new Hummer. Oh, there it is. The parking lot. I remembered where it was. Hey, I like the Mercedes, man. That's nice. There it is, the parking garage. Oh, this place is crazy, though. I don't even know if I really made the announcement, but there's the rental. We got a Dodge Challenger. Well, I'm at the car. I'm sitting inside the car. I didn't even turn it on yet. There's so much traffic. Since I have like a five hour drive, well, it's four hours, but like four and a half to five because of the traffic. So due to having that much of a drive ahead of me, I'm not even feeling like in a rush to get out of here. Like when I'm in Pittsburgh and I know my house is like within an hour, usually I'm just like, God, I just want to get home. But right now I'm just like, oh, I don't know what to do. Oh, well. <laughs>